Hi, this is Dave Bricchetti. I'm planning to take a, an online course at Stanford on artificial intelligence, and I need to learn some math. So I've been watching some great videos from the Khan Academy, uh, including a recent one about how to find a, the, the uh, formula for a line that best matches the a set of given points. And uh, so I learned how that works and saw the how the, these formulas uh, are uh, created. Here's a formula for finding the slope of that line, uh, given things like uh, this is the, the mean of all the x values and the mean of all the y values and things like that. Uh, so I thought I would show how we might use the Scala programming language uh, to do some of that work rather than um, hand figuring out these things. So one thing we can do is we'll make a, a list of the coordinate pairs. So I'm going to create a variable that's a list of a tuple of two doubles. And it's initialized to these values. So what do we have in here? We have 1, 2, 2, 1, and 4, 3. There's 1, 2, there's 2, 1, and there's 4, 3. So now I've created a variable called, called uh, coordinates, or CS, and it has these values. Now I need to do things with the x's and the y's, so I'm going to create a couple more variables. Here's a value, of the, here's a value called x's. And um, so I need to extract the x's from here. So these are tuples, and I can get the first element of each tuple. And I can use, uh, so here's the c's variable, the, the coordinates variable. So I say c's.map, which will visit uh, each of these uh, list elements in turn. And here I can extract the first element. So this gives me the 1 and the 2 and the 4. The 1, the 2, and the 4. These are the x values. The first underscore here refers to the um, coordinate pair that's currently being mapped over. And this underscore is used to indicate which of the two tuple elements I'm interested in. Let's do the same thing for y's. We want the second value. Now we have the y's. 2, 1, and 3, 2, 1, 3, 2, 1, 3. And then we also need to do things like um, multiply the x times y for each coordinate pair and then take the, the mean of that. So let's do um, val x, y's. We take all the coordinates, visit each one, and for each one, which we'll call c, this is a different syntax here for the map, we want to take the result of multiplying the first tuple element by the second one. And this is x, this is y, multiply them together. Now we have a list of 2, 2, 12. So 1 times 2 is 2, 2 times 1 is 2, 4 times 3 is 12. So now we have that. And then if we go um, along with this approach of assigning these intermediate values to variables and then ultimately computing the result. Here's the final product. You see we go on and get some other things here. And the result is we, well, we find the numerator, the x mean times the y mean minus the mean of the x's. So here's the x's and get the mean by taking the sum divided by the size the denominator here and divide the numerator by the denominator and that gives you m and now we have the slope and when we run that program this is what we see so that's an example of taking of learning something from a very good video and then kind of practicing it and applying it in a, a programming language in this case Scala